Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can solve the Crea AI image upscaling problem that many of you must have noticed on the website. So here is an original image. I uploaded this on the Crea website and as you can see, the result was not really nice. It's not showing as much as I wanted it to show because, you know, the face had changed already. But then, using the method that I actually showed you guys, I'm going to show you guys today, alright, in this video, you're going to see the better results that you can generate using Crea AI. Alright, so as you can see, this is the result and it's looking super, super cool. So you come here to your Chrome browser, alright, and you type www.crea.ai. That is the website, alright. So once the website opens up, you'll go to where they have the enhancer options where you can upscale and enhance images. Alright, so if this is your first time actually on the channel, of course, you have to sign up or you have to log in first. Alright, so once you log in there, you can drag or drop your images. So once you click on the drag or drop, you select the image and you scroll up once you select the image the image has to upload first all right i can see this is the image right here so what you just do you just scroll up a little bit you don't have to really make so much changes you come here and select 16 times or 16x so it's going to scale the image 16 times so 16x so that will make it very sharp so there you come here and click on enhance you don't have to change any settings Alright, once you click on enhance, you wait for a few moments and it's going to be enhanced. You can see it's there. Once you click on the image right there, so you see that you just have to click on the image and you can see the image right here. Super cool, right? But then the face is different as you can see. So, but first of all, you go ahead to save. So, you are going to save it using that option there. So, once you save it, it's going to be downloaded into your device. After saving it, you are going to upscale the second time. So, you... We are going to be upscaling two times the first one is the first upscaling the second one we are going to upscale this one that we just downloaded from the website that we already upscaled before all right so you come here and download and click on that one all right that is an already upscaled image but we're going to upscale it again all right so you upload it here and just as you did before you are going to select the 16 times all right and you click on enhance so in a moment it will also be upscaled so you upscale every image two times all right you upscale it two times so that is it so you see now after when you finish upscaling it second time it becomes sharper like this you see that so you go ahead to download it so the next thing you need to do you come here to where you have your pix arts and in pix arts you are going to try to upload the image that you just upscaled right that is the second upscaled image you select it and automatically it's going to open up all right this is the image right here you can zoom in and out you can see the face still looking the way it is so we're going to transform this face now to make it look like your original face here you'll go to where you have add photo you have to select it and you have to select the original picture that you have of the person all right that's the first image you have of the person you come here and add it once you've added it all you just need to do you have to scale up the image Make sure that you scale it exactly from the middle down to the edges. All right, make sure it's well upscaled and it laps very well and aligns very well with the background image. All right, once you are done with that, you're good to go. So the next thing we need to do is we are going to come here and select the eraser tool. All right, let me show you the eraser tool. It's right at the top there. So once you click on the eraser tool, you can see you have options, right? So the option you're going to click on, you come here first to click on the invert. Once you click on invert, it's going to return back to the original image, all right, the background image. And here you can reduce the hardness a little bit. The size is okay, all right, so just reduce the hardness a little bit. So once that is done, you can zoom in and then try to erase the face, all right. So the image is going to be transforming to the original image face. That is the one you just uploaded. So you can see right there the face is looking much more like the original person this is cool right so once you you're done with that you can make sure that you erase everything from the face because with erasing everything from the face then the face will look much clearer and better all right so this is it so just make sure you take your time to make sure that you do it well so once you're done with that then you're good to go you just go ahead to save it so make sure you do it well so once that is done you come here to save you select done and you save it into your device 
once you've saved it to your device you will have to come here to where you have remini app you download the remini app from your play store and once the app opens up you can close this there you go to your enhance option we have the enhance option here on remini so this will help us to add some good effects to the image again so here you click on the enhance again and select the image that you just that saved from your pix ads and you click on enhance so but then if you're using the free version you have to watch an ad first and in a couple of minutes it's going to come it's going to be um, you know enhanced just as you can see right here it's looking cool right so once that is done you can go ahead to save so it's looking cool and it's the original face so you go ahead to save and so for better results you can also once you're done saving it here you can take it over to your lightroom mobile all right so probably if the image is too light and you want to work on it or make it even better you will come here and you select the image all right the one you enhance using remini all right so you just come here to where you have your edit go to details all right you go to your details option you can increase the amount of sharpness you increase the sharpness all right you can also increase the details too or if it's too bright you can come here to where you have your light option click on it increase the exposure or reduce the exposure if you want you know change the contrast change the highlights reduce the highlights or reduce the increase or reduce the shadow if you want so depending on exactly what you want you can edit it to your choice and as, as you can see it's really looking nice so let's you can also change add more details to it so you can come here to details and increase the details a little more so this is really cool and interesting right so once you're done you just have to check it out and you can see it looking really bright and cool so then you can save it onto your device once that is done then you're good to go so thank you so much guys for watching i'll ask that you consider subscribing to my channel for more interesting content like this do have a wonderful day and see you in my next video bye for now